Hello everybody, this is Alice the Dragon, and I have a game here that I think you're gonna like. It's called Mindistry. It is a free game. Uh, I will put a link down in the description, but you can play it on just about anything. There's an Android version. Uh, I'm playing this on Linux. I'm pretty sure there's Windows and Mac versions as well. It's just a plain old Java game. And, uh, yeah, I could play one of the, one of the default ones up here. I also have some ones I've made before, but I think I just want to make something new, something new for you guys. So I don't like that one. Let's randomize. This one's pretty cool. You've got some area right here and you've got this area right here. We just need to link these two. Let's see how it looks with river in it. And uh, in, in this game, river essentially means water everywhere. And uh, I, I don't like that. I don't like that. Um, let's randomize again. That's okay. It's not great. Like We could do like stuff through this way and stuff through this way but no i don't i don't like it randomize again um ooh, a tiny land bridge right there which is interesting we could start up here and then have the monsters come from over here no that's not too bad what does it look like when i add oil Nothing. Zilch. Doesn't do anything. Uh, I wonder what happens if I distort it. Not much. Not much. Might, might as well... Uh, I, I want to see what the oil river looks like. Adds a bunch of oil in a lot of different places. Not necessarily great places. I don't want there to be an oil river. I'd rather that there just be regular oil. Let's randomize again. Uh, still no oil. Randomize again. Oil isn't showing up. Randomize. No? Randomize. No? Randomize. Randomize. There we go. Now we're seeing some oil deposits. Um, this is all right. This is all right. Uh, we're definitely going to need to connect some stuff. So, yeah, let's just go with this. And this, the editor is essentially like MS Paint. On the left here um, are all the flat terrain, and on the right are all the raised terrain that you can't go past. So I'm going to increase my brush size to three. I've got the stone on hand, and I'm just going to start connecting some of these areas. So like that, and like that, and let's do a bit up here and around this way. Kind of cool. Uh, we've got some grass going right there. Uh, are there any other areas that aren't connected? I guess up here isn't connected. So let's add a tunnel. There we go. I'm kind of liking that. I don't have a way to get up on this island. It would be kind of funny to start my spawn on, on this island, but at the same time, that would mean the the monsters would never get to me, and that's not quite fair, is it? Not at all. I, I want to die quickly. <laughs> but what I could do is, you know, make, make, this, make this interesting and just, like, do a land bridge right there. I kind of I want to get some... Yeah, I decrease my brush size to two. Add just a little bit of shallow water on the edges here. There we go. And another grassy thing. And I'm going to make a grassy tunnel going that and up here, because why not? And make it a little bit irregular. There we go. I, I kind of like that. All right, so just for fun, spawn right here. Actually, no, not there. 
let's spawn up here because that's kind of a challenge I'll because ore will not generate on on grass I'm basically going to have to build down here to this um, stone spot and there really isn't going to be much ore for me until I get to here and then there's the oil deposit there which will be crucial to my success because once you get the oil deposit going you can get power and uh, yeah you can you can get coal um whoops that is that is a scroll that zooms in and out uh all right so i want to die quickly i want to die very quickly so i am going to add a whole bunch of monster spawners i'm gonna add i have brush size one i'm gonna add one here that's two pixels i want just one there we go one pixel and uh, one right there not quite it's again two pixels that one was kind of far away that works and one right there we're just gonna make this whole area here our monster area so now we have three actually it look kind of looks like four because I put two pixels there but uh, I don't I don't care now <laughs> uh, looking pretty good just so that I have a little bit of a more fair start I'm gonna put one piece of coal right there and and a little bit of iron right there so I'll be able to get steel right away no matter what and you'll you'll see what I mean once we actually get started all right so that looks good to me let's save that uh, no, not there I just want to save map there we go what should we call this um, how about rough oh, wait no dragons nest there we go because it's in a grassy area and why did it close why did it close just then I hope you can see this actually I think I should stop the recording just so that I can make sure all right hang on a bit guys hang on and we're back we're good okay so dragon's nest here we go uh, I've got my oh I've got a bunch of coal right here next to spawn let's get some iron going once I actually have enough to get the three iron going all right so you've got these drills that that you use uh, the stone drill is the essential drill when placed on stone tiles outputs stone at a slow pace indefinitely so good stuff there very good stuff and I want more iron going that is nice uh, we're gonna want it to go this way and uh, you'll see what I mean I uh, need a smelter I'm gonna do this there we go uh, that actually didn't I, I put that in the wrong spot so wasted a little iron there but it's okay all right so now we go and do that we need we need some iron and we need some steel which we will be getting eventually we've got some friends down south can they reach us from across the water it doesn't look like it I'll probably end up building onto the water to um, weaken them a bit before they go all around the long way but yeah we'll, we'll see how that works yeah it it might work it might not so come on oh I got the coal already there we go and we need a smelter we need 40 pieces of iron we already have enough stone 
I think I can actually do... No, there is not stone underneath there. There's only stone under the stone drills, which is perfectly all right. Uh, I'm going to get those guys going because uh, you can always, 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 always use more weapons. Always, always, always. You do not want to skimp on the weapons in this game. You see those red arrows? That's where the monsters are right now. And they are going to go all the way around the long way and come up through this way. Ooh, there's uranium right there. Oh, nice. I Eventually, I can get the uranium-powered weapons to be, like, right here. And it'll do great. Get some flak right there. There's some iron. So I can get some more weapons going there. Uh, lots of coal. More, more flak will go there. Another one of the big weapons will go right here because there's a uranium deposit. All right, so things are good. Things are good for now. We've just got a lot to do. Oh, ores do spawn on the grass. Okay, okay. That is good to know. All right, get the smelter going. Get the smelter going. We need the smelter. And while we're at it, we gotta wait for the railgun. Yeah, this uh, router will kind of throw things out in a random direction that isn't the way the way it got it from. So it's throwing some into the smelter, and it's and uh, it's sending the rest down the line. Yeah, the smelter is getting the coal directly. Uh, I need to put up some more weapons. Maybe some flamers. Let's let's get some flamers. Okay. Uh, too late. Uh, I can shoot as well. They will kind of ignore me, but I can shoot from pretty far away. So right now I'm the turret. I'm the turret because I do not want any of my stuff to be destroyed. Not yet, anyway. Well, I don't want it to be destroyed at all, so... Uh, yeah. I want to get some iron going. And I'm just gonna do that. Might as well. Okay. Uh, like that. Actually get it the right way around. And we're going to send that back this way. And that actually lines up really well with the iron there. So I think I might actually do that. Use that as another steel maker. Another coal, please. Coal drill. Maybe. Maybe just a little. You know, if I put a router right here, then I can send things this way. There we go. So now it's sending stuff that way. I want another coal drill as soon as I have the iron for it. I can walk over my conveyor belts, so that's convenient. Okay, they're, they're going to take a while to get to me. Which is fine. You know, that's kind of the way the world works. You gotta wait for the good stuff. And I'm going to do that. And that's going to feed into here. And that's going to feed into there. And there's our smelter. Come on, smelter. Also, once this conveyor belt fills up, the router's just going to keep kicking stuff that way, um, you know, towards our base, because this is all full up. But then once the smelter is involved, you know, it takes some out every once in a while. So now I can just send that straight back, and we are good to go. And if I put a router right here, it's going to start sending the stuff into there, which I don't want. I don't want that. 
but I do want some more defensive capabilities. So I'm going to put rail guns over here. And that will give us a little bit more uh, firepower. I can't get around there anymore. So uh, once I get the flak, flak turret going, that'll be so nice. All right. I want more rail guns. Oh, those aren't going to reach anything. These will reach something. These won't. You see that little purple circle, purple circle going around my thing? Well, uh, that is, uh, yeah. yep. Oh, I, I love rail guns. Rail guns are great. They can generally be made pretty quickly. So that is good. That is very good. Okay. Iron here. Get some more steel manufactured. Get some more, uh, Blarg. Get some more guns. You can always use more guns. Smelter, please. Please. Uh, smelter, come on. 23 out of 40. 24 out of 40. Oh, we need more, more iron coming in. I didn't set this up. They've just been waiting patiently. All right. Get that going. Why didn't I put some through here? Whatever. Uh, okay, so that's that's doing good. That's doing good now. And uh, get that smelter because we want rail guns right next to it. If I can actually get some iron going to it. I keep forgetting which key is the turn block key. Alright, uh, there we go. And there we go. And this one wants to send some stuff out as well. Okay, that's all of them. Now that's coming to the smelter which is generating our railgun stuff. And I'm going to go ahead and put some, put some stuff in the way. We want to protect this. We want to protect our supply. We want to protect our weapons. Yeah, get him! Get him! Ah, I'm in build mode. Oh. See, they will go after the vulnerable bits if given half the chance. So, you know, you gotta cover up your holes. They will actually divert to hit a particular spot. Which uh, is uh, not always good. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, can I do the flak turrets yet? Oh wait, no, I need titanium for that, and there's no titanium on my little island. So that sucks. Won't be able to do much with that. I kind of want to put another... Let's put another railgun right here? No, that will not work actually. So let's put a router here and put a couple more rail guns right here. Pew pew pew. I want titanium and I'm going to have to venture out for it. Luckily, my weapons right now are good enough. Uh this would be a good spot for flamer turrets actually. So let's get some flamer turrets going. Flames, 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 flames. And I want to have enough room to get by while still uh, leaving room for that. 
which uh, uh, I'm, I'm just kind of thinking to myself now. Uh, some iron there in an awkward spot. Uh, this is another good place for flame turrets. If I can actually get them, get them down. Get get another one there. Uh, uh, leave some room. Uh, putting up stone walls just because they're cheap and easy to make and they provide some protection. And I am still working on that, uh, that spot. That would be a good spot for a flak turret, I think, once we actually get the flak going. Oh, where's titanium? There's no titanium. Oh, there, there we go. There's some titanium. Gonna definitely have to protect that. Maybe go up through the wall here. Ugh. Like you can make. Oop. Die! 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 Oh, those are little kamikaze ones. They just run up to stuff and explode. All right. Flamer. Make, making some progress. Making some progress. Yeah, the thing that's really limiting us right now, I think, is uh, our lack of lack of iron, essentially. I look forward to when we can get the deuterium going. Uh want those flat turrets too. Let's get some stone going from this spot right here. I think these all... Okay, so if we're gonna put stone going down this line, we're gonna need a sorter. So let's get a sorter going. We'll put that right there. Now it's only gonna send iron up or north or whatever you want to think of it as. And anything else it gets, it's going to kick out to the side, which is also great stuff. Although it does mean that we don't have iron going down the line anymore, which I don't like. So let's get another router going just ahead of that. That way it'll just send the excess down the line and, uh, and we won't have that clog. Uh, and while we're at it, Let's put a Gatling turret next to it. Why not? It's going to take that take that extra iron, and it's going to use it. Good stuff. Uh, all right. We need to secure that titanium deposit. So... Going up here. Going around. Get some more coal going, get some more flamers going. Go put one more right there. And uh, will these? Yeah, these will reach. More coal, please. If, uh, if you've watched Star vs. the Forces of Evil, um, you will know what I say when I say, keep your pinkies at 90 degrees. More tea, please. <laughs> uh, if you haven't, it's, it's a fun show. I, 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 really, I really like it. Um, apparently, the theme song uh, was essentially the pitch for the whole show. <laughs> uh, yeah, and, and they just made up the theme song and they played it at the board meeting and it's like, it's going to get a little weird. It's going to get a little wild. I'm not from around here. I'm from another dimension. <laughs> so uh, if that appeals to you and you haven't seen Star vs. the Forces of Evil, I do like it. I, I like uh, recommending things I like. Ah, pew, 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 pew. Yeah, see those flamers? They are... 
really good. They they do very good damage, um, but they have to do it close range. It might be worth it to get some coal generators and some healers going there. Actually, that is a really good idea. Because those two back there actually aren't doing much. So, uh, coal generator, please. We'll get those two. Um, actually, we'll put the flamer back in this spot, just in case they zoom by. And now we need a distributor and a repair turret. And it's going to essentially make sure that all of these are at optimum health. And uh, that uh, is, is very good, very good for them. You know, actually, this, this one right here can take a uh, take a healer and I I like to put a lot of healers I know they're called repair turrets but they're healers <laughs> at least as far as I'm concerned put a little more protection there um, is yeah that that would actually reach all the way down there the more healers you have the better because, yeah, you know, the more healers you have, the faster they can repair stuff. And the further they can reach. And they will gather energy. And my phone is ringing. I don't know you. You can leave a message. All right. Uh, okay, so that's a pretty good defense point going on there. Um... Uh, Get a defense point going here. Just basic Gatling turrets. A little bit more. Come on. There we go. And steel walls are good. Especially the big ones. Just kind of getting our basics down. Gonna put all the way around. Really no reason for me to get extra iron at this point in time. Alright, so I want to take a look at the tunnel and see how you know how far it can reach. Place one tunnel leading into the block to be tunneled under and one on the other side. Make sure both tunnels face opposite directions, which is towards the blocks they are inputting or outputting to. Can I can I just send it straight through here? Or better yet, oh that's that's way too long. That's way too long. Okay. So let's actually put it here because it's a little bit more protected behind this block. And that one I will have to walk around to. So Going around, going around, uh, and uh, get some conveyors going there, and I'm going to send them up over the lake. Pew, pew, pew. Yep, I heard that, I heard that. Uh, would it be worth it to get some distributors and flak turrets right here? Yes. You always want more weapons. <laughs> always, 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 always want more weapons. Uh, Gatling turrets. Gatling turrets. Just in case they get too close. Alright. So you can actually bridge over the water using this. So get it going there and there. And go all the way over here, and not all the way to that. Let's add a router right here. There's plenty of stone going to that. Actually, 
the, these, these aren't really worth it. So we're doing that. We're doing that. We're good. We're good. We're going to get some flak turrets going on that coal deposit at some point. But we still need the titanium. So let's, let's just test that tunnel and see how well it can do. Uh, and all we need to do that is a piece of stone. Is it sending it through? Doesn't appear to be. Darn. I was really hoping that that would work. Okay. All right, all right. So, yeah, we're just doing some experimenting here. Let's uh, see if it can get through four blocks. Uh, all right. Will it send it through? Will it send it through? Come on. Get some more stone going. Come on. Drill. Drill, 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 baby. Is it? No, it should be working. Come on. There we go. It sent one through. Uh, okay, that that isn't working either. Okay, so uh, maybe three blocks will will do it. All right. Uh, stuff going in, stuff going out. Test it. I think its limit might be two blocks, which is annoying. But uh, okay, okay. So we will just have to go around this, which uh, is not fun. Okay, that was my alarm. Time to stop the episode. And this time I'm going to remember to save. Uh, <laughs> I did record one episode of this and forgot to hit save. So let's actually save the game right now. New save. Save name. Dragon. Okay. Uh, I will see you in the next episode. Bye!